Hello, welcome for Entrepreneurial Venture in Entrepreneurship Management 2, where it composes of four phases in entrepreneurial. Phase 1 is idea generation, phase 2 is opportunity evaluation, phase 3 is a planning or strategy, and phase 4 is a company planning. And now, let's begin with the phase 1, idea generation. Under Entrepreneur's Idea, as business-minded student from Bachelor of Physical Education, we want to launch a company that is congruent with the content of our program and has its primary mission, the provision of services and manufacture products of superior quality for the benefit of our future clients. In addition, we discovered that the top priority of all the innermost firms is the production of apparel, entities, and equipment that the players are unable to pay. Because of this, we devised the idea of establishing a sports with yourself for DIY and merchandising businesses that offers services of superior quality and readily available goods. As a result of this, we have a concept for developing an innovative product that is reasonably priced and enables customers to design the items they create in an imaginative manner and help them to remain competitive in the face of fast-shifting trends. Company logo. Company logo is important because it serves as the landmark of our company. Our company logo was named the Atleta DIY Merchandise. It is made for our valued customer for them to have less expenses in their needs for sports, like materials and equipment. Our company description, the Atleta Team Merchandise was created on May 15, 2022. It is owned by the big students namely Bragado, Buena Agua, Boada, Cabanilla, Tinoso, Tarentino, Tuaso, and Intugate. The main branch of the Atleta Team Merchandise is located in the city of Ordineta, province of Pangasinan. This company aims to satisfy value customers by providing quality products at affordable prices. In addition to that, this company sells products related to sports. You can purchase anything from sport tumblers, socks, towels, blue pads, bandages, sport bags, elbow pads, muscle tape, cups, double bags, sport headbands, and sport lanyards. The company's sportswear is not what you would expect to find on the market. Rather, it was created and sold by the company using a DIY process that is quite different from what you would find on the market. This makes the company's sportswear unique in comparison to what you would find on the market. In contrast to any other company, every piece of sportswear and materials possesses a similar capacity and quality of producing things that are not only simple to put on and creativity on it via do it yourself or DIY design. Hashtag we care your imaginative style. Sample products. Our company provides a DIY sports and equipment. Shots us, thunder, socks, towel, knee pads, bandage, sports bag, elbow pad, muscle tape, wheeler tape, cup, duffel bag, sports head bag, sports lanyard, and face mask. We selected these DIY products to cherish our consumers and help them spend less on their sports related needs. Next is a phase two, which is the opportunity evaluation. We, as an entrepreneur, learned quickly that practically all athletes do not have the financial means to purchase the expensive goods, such as sports equipment and materials that are offered for sale by the industry's most dominant companies. The most important thing in this process is to evaluate whether an idea is a business opportunity. These methods will also help in the process of modification and adoption of a business idea to the environment in which the business venture will develop. Complete evaluation of a business opportunity includes a risk assessment. An honest appraisal of the potential risk and period in your new business can help you prepare for possible problems and decide whether the risks are worth to the investment. This company has a huge advantage over its competitors in the market for sports items. This company has a substantial competitive edge over other merchants of sporting goods since the product was manufactured through a do-it-yourself technique, which resulted in the creation of an innovative product that was in keeping with current trends in sports. Company team. Businesses equal very quickly if done right. Otherwise, they get stagnant in the process of the product and just leave alone. Because of this, team members you hire must be able to do the role you need as the company moves through these evolution points. 
They need to be bad as awesome, smarter than you, experts in the role they were hired for. So always leave applicants a test to see if they not only meet it, but exceed the position you're hiring for. A company that has been invested in this idea will be lost in the case that the company does not achieve the desired level of success. A company will rise to the position of the country's top do-it-yourself sportswear and sports materials brand with several branches opening up not just in the Philippines but around the world. Next is the phase 3, which is strategy and planning. Target market customer to the Atleta DIY merchandise business can be found in Urdaneta City. This is because the store's market can be reached at the aforementioned location because the majority of the company's sporting goods are distinctive and creative. Trading in them should be quite simple for the business. The following types of people are considered to be the company's target customer. First is the school universities. Many coaches and students participate in the sport at this institution, making it an ideal location to showcase the company's sports products and services. Further, the business can market its product to schools that focus on health and fitness. The next one is fitness gym. The gym has a requirement for the acquisition of sports, equipment, and gym. Last one is sporting goods and fitness shoppers are a key target customer not only for a manufacturer's or sporting equipment and clothing, but also for equipment to indoors, outdoors, and for wearables. Our company's business model, it is comprehensive strategy for making money from the sale of goods and services, and to offer high quality products and value-oriented product offerings for the customer. In positioning statement, the Atlanta DIY merchandise is committed to establish a long-lasting, creative, and innovative brand loyalty to the industry by featuring the male and female athletes of all levels. The company is expanding its focus, developing a region and legitimate identity for the brand through a brand. All business goals and milestones are important, but the most important ones will be the things that are carefully handled, planned, and put into motion. Whatever eventual goal, it is important to understand what needs to be done and why. Last but not the least, the phase 4, which is the company planning. Our company situation, we're in Gonzaga Street, or the next city, that's in the Philippines. 2480 was the address of the company's physical location because we saw that there are many potential clients in the vicinity of the area and the fitness facilities. We decided to set up shop in this particular region. As a result, we formulate practical strategies with the purpose of selling our goods and services of a cheaper cost but simultaneously increasing the product's quality and ensuring that it is long lasting. As a consequence of this athletes no longer come to venture into other places. of modern technologies, the Atleta DIY merchandise wants to create an interest in the mindsets of our valued customers by answering the use of social media platforms. To widen its connection worldwide, the Atleta DIY merchandise is launching goods and services via Facebook page account, the Atleta DIY merchandise, Twitter and or TikTok account, capital D-A-D-I-Y merch, and Instagram account, capital D-A-D-I-Y merch, our website account, the Atleta DIY merch or contact us the number of 0945-975-5401. For more information about the company's profile, they can acquire at the said site of social media accounts. Aside from that, the company have an online shop you can download it now, the Daddy Merch app, which for the customer is easy to access all available goods and services of the company. Moreover, the company continually giving flyers, promotional letters, and exercising public relation to all sports businesses and organizations. The The Athletic DIY merchandise is marketed and distributed through online and offline channels to reach a wider audience and generated more sales. To guarantee that our items are up to standard with our customers are looking for. We take care of everything from the marketing to the packing to the shipping. Our operation organizational chart. Our shop manager is Ms. Adrian Bragado that's responsible in ensuring that all employees are working cooperatively toward common goals and store standards are constantly met. Assistant manager Mr. Jeremy Arvin Agua and Jaya Joy Tsgaren. 
They are responsible in operation of excellence to marginal tasks like planning and coordinating activities, monitoring stock levels, and assessing employee contributions. Merchandising Manager, Mr. Jomer Tolentino and Janine Cabanilla. They are responsible in controlling the purchasing process, predicting the needs and trends for inventories, and negotiating with suppliers are all part of this responsibility. And our customer services executives, William Trazon and Christine Fee Wada. They are responsible and representative of the company's customer service department who listen to their concerns and provide relevant solutions. Lastly, our client's executive services he is responsible for function as a link between the external customer of their organization and the internal departments of the organization. He is Mr. John Abraham Pinoza. He is addressing the client's issues by communicating with consumers via email, the phone, and in-person meetings, in addition to communicating with other members of the team. One of the mission of the Athleta DIY Merchandise Company, they are the top one of all the business here at the Philippines in terms of producting sports goods and services. When it has grown, it would be because the world's leading DIY brand of sports apparel, materials, and equipment here are the company's hands. In 2022, developing business concepts, essentially a business concept is a great description and idea behind the existence of business. the responsible of our company's successes. Our Chief Executive Officer is Adrian Sabalita Joy Brigado. Our Manager Production, John R. R. Binaagoy and his worker, Mr. William Trazon, John Abraham Tignoso, and Joe Martolentino. Jaya Joy Togeli is our Manager in Marketing. And its worker is Paul Lapurga, Christine Guada, and Janine Cabanil. Again, we are the Diathleta D Merchandise is committed to establish a long-lasting creative an innovative brand loyalty in the industry by catering to individuals of all levels. The company is expanding its focus on developing an original and genuine identity for the brand. Through a process, a do it yourself method as it is in order to achieve the mission of providing the highest quality products that are available on the market. Hashtag we carry your imaginative style.